Hi everyone, it's Nona Grace and I'm from Western New York. Today was a beautiful day outside. In fact, I take you for a little walk outside. But before we do that, um, today I went shopping and I guess the coronavirus scare has hit our area too because when I was in the store, I took notice and there was no toilet paper. That's the big thing that was that I noticed. And then I did notice a few shelves were a little bit less stuff on them. But then when I went in to get my protein powder, because I like to put the protein powder, the chocolate, in my coffee, and that just adds that little flavor to make the coffee taste good. And when I went over in that section, I took a peek into the medicine area, and there is no cold medicine or flu medicine. Those are all gone. Those shelves were bare. I didn't look at the baby wipes because I didn't need any, and so I didn't look to see. I could have probably looked there too. But I did notice a little bit of um, scarcity of things. They are um, going to be putting our college on spring break. After spring break, they're going to do online classes. The schools here are still opened. The parade in Buffalo, the St. Patty's Day parade, was canceled. I've noticed on the news they're also talking about any athletic things are doing their athletics without spectators. They're not allowing any more than 50 people in a gathering. And ven venues that have like 500 people are cut in half. They're allowing only 250 people in those venues. So it's I guess pretty pretty busy out there you don't notice it if you stay home a lot which I do stay home a lot and I did run into a couple people that I knew and that was probably it and so I will take you to my video I hope you enjoy the little walk outside and I'm going to show you the chickens and I'm going to show you Jim he says he was working <laughs> I was he was he was working but in my mind, he's playing because he's using his new, I called it, I think, a 4x4 or something. I don't know what I called it, but it's a, it's his, what is that thing called? It's a four-wheeler. A four-wheeler. I don't know. I call it, Whatever it is, you'll know what it is. TV. Even if I call it the wrong thing, you'll know what it is. Mm -hmm. And he was rolling the lawn. He had the, the heavy roller behind because our lawns get bumpy and in order to make them nice we roll them so that they're nice when you go to mow them i just came in from getting an egg and i got this one so far that's one of the little birds and jim's got the tractor out apparently he's mowing or not mowing but he's rolling move jake stay I think I've got him in the camera. I can't, can't see. Oh, there he is. He's over there. Oh, it's so bright out here today. It's beautiful, actually. He's got the using that four by four that he fixed. Again, I'll show you the egg. I gotta put the egg away. Oh, hello, everybody. They're all running up this way. Oh, you are just a bunch of chicken littles. In they go. 
You might as well go in. Hi, Jake. Well, I'm going to take you for a little walk. I'm going to go around the porch. There's a neighbor going up. I will take a little walk and see what I can see in Jim's in the front yard now. I hope I'm in the camera because this one doesn't have the reverse so you can see where you're at. I'm just kind of there. I will open the gate. I gotta open the gate. This is the gate I'm not talking about. I gotta pull it in a little bit, push the thing open. Oops, gotta go this way. Open the gate. There, now I can. A lot of steps today. I actually went shopping for a little while and um, I think the coronavirus scare has hit our area. We're in just a little tiny small area but the college is going to start uh, I think on the 23rd right after spring break when the students get back. They're going to um, have them do their studies at home. I'm not looking at you, it's because I'm looking where I'm going. Um, and I noticed in the shelves, we're a lot emptier. I only went down for the, the half and half. I had to go down for that. We had about three left in the refrigerator and I really like to have six so that I don't have to go for a long time. And um, so I went down and got that. And I noticed that there was no toilet paper. That's the thing that I noticed. And I went in tonight because I bought some allergy. I had to buy, oh, I'm, the sun's gonna be in my eyes now. I bought some allergy um, medicine because for whatever reason, things make me sneeze. I don't have allergies, but I do buy it just in case um, I get some dust or whatever, pollen, who knows. They say that when, if you don't have allergies when you're young, you'll get them when you're old, and maybe that's what's happening. But um, I just bought that, and I noticed all the cold medicines were, were gone. So apparently the things for flu and cold, they're not on the shelves. Those shelves were empty. I don't know what I want to talk about. Here he comes. Oh no. Here we go. There he is. Oh. He's got his extra gas on the back of his tractor too. I'll turn you around slower. I forget that I could be making you dizzy. Don't know. He did move his um, motorcycle up front. He plans to use that, I think to go to work. It's been, it's nice. It's actually nice. I just have a light sweater on today. So I'll show you where the motorcycle is. You put the motorcycle right there. And he backed the truck up a little bit. But he sets the, he must be, he's going to use the trike. Because the two wheel is still in the back. And yes, there's our bags that have to go to the dump. This is where we put them when we have to go to the dump. And there is recyclable in there too, so that will go to the recycle sign. But, yep. Oh, wow, he's got a lot of mud on his truck. My goodness, where the heck did he go that he got so much mud? We have a paved driveway. But I think at where he works, there's mud. So you're gonna be getting even dustier and dirtier, but that's okay. This is what we're gonna take when we go to Kentucky, to Louisville. <laughs> I love saying Louisville, because if you were to spell it, that's why it's hard to spell. The English language is hard to spell because if you say Louisville, 
you would write Louisville instead of Louisville. And um, like Feb February, it's February. Burr is in there. You forget that there's an R. That's that's why the English language is so so funny to use. My um, rooster house. I love my rooster house. I'm showing you my rooster house. It looks like a peddler's a peddler's um little thing. It looks like I should be selling snake oil, but instead, um, it's got things that I want to put on sale. Let's see. Open it up. I haven't been in here since I closed it up. Oh, wow. I don't think I can open it. It's swollen. One, two, three. Pull, 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 pull. The bottom is swollen. Well, maybe I can put my hand up here. Oops, no, still swollen. Let me bring myself up. Or I can't even open it. Oh my goodness. Well, anyways, there's stuff in there. But not everything's for sale. Lock it down. I can't open it. I would have to have two hands. Two hands to do that job. I only have one because I'm holding you and whoops, I'm, we were really close. Um, I was holding you in one and holding me in the other. Or the, yeah, I'm in the other. My other hand is busy. Guess we'll go in. I've had enough more. I got, I don't, still haven't gotten my 5,000 steps a day. That's pretty sad that I don't get it. When I was working, I'd have five, I'd have 10,000 steps before 2.30 in the afternoon. Whereas now, I can go all day and I, if I get 3,000, I've gotten a lot. Wow, there's a lot of traffic today. Everybody's out and about. And Silver Fox is back on her nest. Good girl. I took the egg, so you're okay now. Bring the eggs in the house. And these are the eggs that I'm getting these colors. Look at that, how pretty the colors. This is from my Americana. And these are from the new birds. I must have, this one looks a little bluer than these. A little bit different. I don't know if it shows up on the camera, but it looks a little bluer. They're pretty eggs. So I hope you enjoyed this little walk outside and the chickens and looking at my little bit of eggs that I show you. And I will talk to you all again tomorrow. Have a great day. Bye.